Getting closer to home tonight, a LaPorte County couple is accused of abandoning a 13 year old child. The pair adopted the child and now the neglect case filed this week further alleges the teen was the victim of cruel confinement as well. Uh, Mark Peterson joins us live with this developing story. Hey, Mark. You know, court documents allege the children got whoopings with belts and paddles on their buttocks. In one case, a teen who misbehaved was allegedly made to eat oatmeal with vinegar as punishment. Court documents indicate there are three children in the household of Richard and Patricia Heights, but it's the oldest, an adopted 13-year-old who was said to have been out of control for about six months and needed more help than the couple could provide. The pair did admit they did not seek help for the child in the form of therapy or medication management, and when they eventually did take the child to a mental health hospital, they outright refused to pick the child up upon discharge, fearing for the safety of other children in the house. The case also alleges neglect by cruel confinement that the teen was forced to sleep in the family's camper in the backyard as much as a week to 10 days at a time with no electricity, no heat in the fall and winter. Court documents say the child told authorities it was cold some nights, but they did give me blankets. While the camper had a bathroom, the child was not allowed to use it. He said he instead had to use grocery style bags. And the initial hearing in this case set in LaPorte County for Friday morning. Okay, we'll keep you posted as always. Just disturbing to hear some of those details. Mark Peterson in studio. We appreciate the update. Mark, thank you. Hey